Hi everybody, it's Isological, and today I have a video demoing the Flicko, the Flick, Flicko, Flicker uploading capabilities of my uh, bare bones Flicker uploader for the Raspberry Pi. So basically, you can see over here, this is a uh, FTP session running on the Pi again, and right, you can see that instead of uh, just a list of files like it was before, now I have subfolders. So the Pi, the program is now capable of uh, walking through the subfolders and selecting the files. You can see I have six ready for upload. So, um, now I'll open up my, this is the account I'm developing the Flickr under, so you can see I have no photos in here, so I'll refresh, no photos and no sets, and if you can guess what's going to happen next, you'll see that the Pi is capable of uploading all the photos and then dumping all the ones that it did upload into a set, so it's a pretty robust program. So, the program's already running, so you can see that toggle the switch, moves the LEDs around, so it's set now to flicker mode, and I will start the process, and now it is uploading the photos to Flickr, so um, it will take a moment to do this, so stand by I guess, it's got to upload six pretty large photos, you can see that the it up once it uploads it says a number of, the number of photograph it is, and then the ID, and then this is just for me because the way I'm listing it for the uh, adding to the set process, uh, it uses a Python list with them, which I'm not really familiar with. So that double check right there is just for my purpose right now. Obviously, the user the user of this device is never going to see any of this. They're just going to see the fact that the LED is red right now, and that means the photos are uploading. So we're halfway there. The three out of the six are uploaded. So um, it creates, it uploads all the photos, and then creates a list, and then dumps or not a list, a set, and then dumps the IDs of the photos, which is from a list, which is from this list, into an photo set add function that's in the program I'm using. So you can see now it adds all, added all six to those to the set, and now the upload is complete. So I'll go over here and refresh, and there we go. Six photos uploaded, go to sets, and there's the set with six photos. So very simple, very bare, very bare bones, almost no user input at all. The user would not see any of that stuff, so it's just one button, and then uploads into a set. And the set is called uploaded at, and then the time that they're uploaded at. So, thank you for watching, and if you have any questions or suggestions, please leave me a comment. Um, it's very good to have uh, multiple people help me develop this, even if it's just a question or a comment. And from here, I'm going to work on the uh, way I deliver the photos to the user. So once they're on Flickr, I'd like it to send the uh, user an email, and then they can get the email and access the, f the photos from there. Instead of having to go and sign into Flickr and stuff, uh, I'd rather them um, use an email sort of protocol thing. So yeah, thank you for watching, and goodbye.